How long can drones can stay in the air? The team behind the Persistent Aerial Reconnaissance and Communications Vehicle System at CyPHY Works have tried to make the word persistent reach new heights in aerial reconnaissance. The six-rotor park never needs to land. In addition to a camera system, park has additional payload capacity for communications devices. If additional payload capacity is required, the camera payload can be removed. There is a microfilament system that makes park capable of aerial coverage and HD footage for as long as you decide. It's actually our tether that sets us head and shoulders above the competition, said the company. While small cables normally mean low power and poor communications, CyPHY Works said that their patented system flips that dynamic. They get high power and they get high definition communications through a tiny cable, thanks to novel electronics. This is an extremely thin wire, the tether is thinner than a headphone cable but strong enough to reel in the drone if necessary, said Will Knight, senior editor for AI at MIT Technology Review. It is tethered to the ground to transmit power and data. The fact that it is tethered, noted Knight, means the vehicle cannot travel very far. The company's site said their microfilament is impervious to jamming and unaffected by water, power lines, and other possible interferences. The microfilament connects the robot to its ground control station, so communications can't be intercepted, spoofed, or otherwise compromised, it added. Its advantages include endurance, ground power enables flight durations measured in days, not minutes, it can produce infrared footage for night vision, and the vehicle has real-time access to the GCS computer.